Andrew Fabian looks out at the night sky. He does it with the most powerful tools on Earth. I make use of optical telescopes, infrared telescopes, radio telescopes. So I, I, I'm prompted mostly by what I see in the X-ray band, but nowadays you've got to take all wavelengths into account. Here's what the Perseus cluster of galaxies looks like with an optical telescope. And here, a very similar view taken with an X-ray telescope. X-rays are a kind of light. It's just the frequency is a thousand times higher than that of visible light. And so if you go out and look at the night sky yourself, you see the visible light sky. But if you look with X-ray telescope, you'll look at frequencies a thousand times higher, and you're looking at objects typically that are a thousand times hotter. In the universe, there's gas between galaxies that gets squeezed up when galaxies cluster together, and they become very strong X-ray sources. I've been looking at the interaction between black holes in the centers of these clusters and in the cluster atmospheres, uh, trying to understand how the energy from the black hole gets transmitted out into the surrounding gas. The pinpoint at the center of this image is a black hole as seen through an X-ray telescope. The gravitational pull of a black hole is so enormous that nothing can escape, not even light. Black holes cause the gases that surround them to spin as they fall into the hole, like water flowing into a drain. But black holes also spew out a plume of gas that may form new stars. And Fabian also thinks that celestial gases could make noise as well, but we humans will never hear it. When we talk about sound waves that we hear, we're talking about hundreds of cycles per second. And I'm talking about one cycle per 10 million years. At Cambridge, one of the world's most ancient universities, Andrew Fabian is a scientist at the ambitious cutting edge of his field. I'm hoping to continue to use the best telescopes in the world, make new discoveries, study things in more detail. Um, there's so much to do, and I find it very exciting. For the very exciting discoveries he has made in his field thus far, Andrew Fabian is the 2020 Kavli Prize Laureate in Astrophysics. <laughs>